In this video we're going to look at whether traction control works for or against you on sand. Now the term traction control is actually an umbrella term for multiple different programs and two which are important is stability control which looks like this. Watch as stability control breaks individual wheels to keep the car under control. Stability control definitely works against you on sand as it tries to break individual wheels to correct the car's course and it doesn't need to do that on sand. Just watch this Jimny fight against its stability control. And stability control will even cut or restrict the throttle if it detects that the car is getting into what the computers think is a dangerous situation. But brake traction control is different. That simply brakes a spinning wheel and only a spinning wheel and it does not restrict the throttle or brake individual wheels to course correct the car. So let's see what happens when I've turned both brake traction control and ESC off so no electronics in my Ranger. Now I'm going too slow on this little sand dune but it's just for the purposes of demonstration. Come to a halt, increased revs, absolutely nothing happens. Just pure open diffs. Car digs itself in. Car just digs itself in. Absolutely nothing useful happens. Now the Ranger has got brake traction control enabled but ESC is off and again driving slowly for the purposes of demonstration. Now watch that right front wheel. Gets the brakes applied to it, the car is able to pull forwards. Now that's exactly what you want in sand. Now of course this is how to drive that particular obstacle, second or third low with a little bit more momentum. So how do you get your car with brake traction control enabled but ESC disabled? Well, good question, it does vary. What you can start by doing is placing your car into four-wheel drive if it's a part-time four-wheel drive, locking the centre diff if it's all-wheel drive. Once you've done that, if you've got a sand mode, enable it, and on top of that, press the stability control button once. All of that should disable stability control for you and leave brake traction control active, which is what you want, but it does vary on a vehicle-by-vehicle -vehicle basis. Now what I'm saying here isn't just theory, I have actually driven a large number of vehicles in sand. So my TD5 Defender had BTC but no ESC, this one also had ESC, this Range Rover had everything you can imagine including train response as did this Freelander, went very well on sand and my Discovery 3 again um, all the electronics. Soft Raiders, the Santa Fe went great on sand as this did Jaguar F-Pace. And this Mitsubishi Triton, again, brake traction control enabled, ESC off, same for the Fortuna, and same for this Pajero, able to kick up that sand, no throttle restriction. So I hope you found this video useful. If you've got any questions, please drop them in the comments, and thanks for watching.